Chris Badger. Thomas Right Wing Tribune There's reportedly one big reason why the NFL took sweeping action Wednesday in adopting a new national anthem policy prior to the start of the 2018 season. Fox News reports. And he resides at 1600 Pennsylvania Avenue in Washington. Our league is F. G. terrified of Trump. We're scared of him, one unnamed source told Bleacher Report as reaction to the plan poured in. I don't think people should be staying in the locker rooms, but still I think it's good, Trump told Fox News Brian Kilmeade in an exclusive interview. You have to stand proudly for the national anthem. You shouldn't be playing, you shouldn't be there. Maybe they shouldn't be in the country. Screenshot slash Fox News outnumbered the NFL has gotten things wrong before, but in the recent history of this league, it has gotten fewer things more horribly, disgracefully, stupidly, terribly wrong than what it decided to do Wednesday in trying to half-heartedly stop players from protesting during the national anthem. In a statement released by the league, team owners decided that starting this season, players can stay in the locker room during the anthem. If players take a knee to protest, say, unarmed black and brown people being unjustly shot by law enforcement, Commissioner Roger Goodell can potentially fine both teams and players. Essentially, the league is trying to shove the protests out of sight by putting them in the locker room. And by fining players who want to publicly protest, it is also trying to make this a financial decision for players. Bleacher Report this season. All league and team personnel shall stand and show respect for the flag and the anthem. Personnel who choose not to stand for the anthem may stay in the locker room until after the anthem has been performed. Tilda Roger Goodell do not believe the hype and lies spewed by Goodell and the NFL. They only care about the green. The financial hit they took last season. Thoughts it. Nothing more. This is far from over and because of the NFL front office lack of sign and the coward Roger Goodell, now the issue will be a long time fight and further destroy the NFL. PIC.twitter.com slash 3 vuji 4 ta NFLPA at NFLPA May 23, 2018 Those who truly have our brothers' backs, please continue to boycott all things NFL and share the hell out of the articles. We need to keep the fight up and never allow such pathetic and blatant hate and division in our nation. The NFL is cowardly and pathetic. The NFL should fear the fans. We are the ones with the money, the ones who used to love our teams in the battle in the trenches. Because they spit all over us, they have been losing money, but not enough to force them to see the blunt truth of their actions. Keep it up. Chris Badger. Thomas is a veteran who served our country as an army combat medic. Together we will make America great again. God bless. Dean James 3% Right Wing Tribune Be sure to follow us on Nation in Distress and America's Freedom Fighters on Facebook.